What's up, everyone? The game does we're here back with a back with a brand new playthrough, and we're starting off the Last of Us for the PS3. Not Welcome to the last of four <laughs> by three ratios. <laughs> <laughs> and no, we're not doing the remastered version. It's mostly because I delete the game because it took up too much space. I thought you would have bought that game physically. Well, I actually actually got for free when I ordered the PS4 because they gave me a code with it. When I order for Amazon, it, you know what's funny? It was the default version when I bought the uh, PS4, just a plain old PS4 box cover, and I and I still got the Last of Us remastered. Oh yeah, reason why I chose to do this playthrough because uh, not too long ago during the uh, the PlayStation Experience uh, event. They, they had confirmed uh, Last of Us Part 2. So I decided to start uh, the, the Last of Us uh, 1 just to get the hype on. I'm not excited for the second one. <laughs> I am. Despite the fact it was a CG trailer. I'm excited for it. Despite the fact it was a CG trailer. But I'll get even more excited when I see gameplay. I'm just, I'm just glad. I'm really excited till I see some gameplay. What I'm trying to say is that I'm I'm just glad that they finally confirmed it after it my suspicions. Going to happen. Yeah. Oh yeah. If you if you watch my let's play of this, some of the options wasn't even there. Like grounded mode, that wasn't there because of the update. And yes, I will be covering uh, Left Behind, but I've been doing some thinking. When we get to Left Behind, um. I'm actually going to do Left Behind after we get past a certain chapter. Just so it can make sense. I have not played this game in a while. Yeah, me neither. Last time I played was the PS4 yes. version. This is going to be interesting going through this uh, again, at least like this. So, what this game is about, it's pretty much a zombie uh, a, a cop a copolypse. Apocalypse. Apocalypse. It's like the end. Jesus Christ, you butchered that word so bad. <laughs> yeah, it's like the end of the world shit right here. Think of it as Resident Evil 6. It's the end of the world as we know it. You did not just do that. <laughs> you did yes, not did. do this. Yes, I did. <laughs> I had to, I'm sorry. <laughs> Alright, so meet the main protagonist. The guy on the left is uh, Joel. A.K.A. Troy Baker and his daughter Sarah. A.K.A. He's kind of a dick in this game. Who, Troy Baker? No, Joel. Yeah, yeah, Joel. Let's call him Joel. But he, but he, Troy, Troy Baker does the voice of Joel. If you guys wondered. Yeah, Troy Baker's not an asshole. <laughs> Joel's kind of a dick in this game. <laughs> Especially the Ellie. So yeah, it's Joel's birthday. Drugs. I sell hardcore drugs. Start helping out with the mortgage. I kind of like this little banter they have right here, but <laughs> I think she was being sarcastic when she said I'm, I'm selling hardcore drugs. Well, obviously. Yeah, because it's it's, it, it's kind of cute. Yeah. <laughs> you thought that was weird? Why would he let his daughter sell uh, hardcore drugs? Is one. one I'm assuming he's a, he's a much more responsible parent than that. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. The only difference between the PS3 version and PS4, well, the, the just the frame rate. The frame rate's a little better. No, the frame rate's doubled. <laughs> yeah. And some of the textures is is, is like bright. Who seen? Honestly, if you ask me, like, is like. I'm, I've seen some. I've seen footage. I haven't actually played the remastered version yet. Yeah. But it's like the texture difference is almost like the texture difference between like uh, let's just say Uncharted Three mm -hmm. on PS3 yeah. and the remastered version. Like the texture difference really isn't that big. Like mostly it's just the. Hey, where's the lack of two from Mario 64?
Oh yeah, that's oh that's oh that's his, uh, his birthday a card. Commercial mechanic they reuse in Uncharted Four. Oh wow, I didn't know that. I I do know Jack and Daxter makes appearance in this game on, on a board game. Well, Naughty Dog has this tendency of trying to slip in little Easter eggs of uh, some of their older games into their newer ones. Wait, who's seen Dawn of the Wolf? Does that movie even exist? Guess not. Well, yeah. Who likes playing interactive cutscenes? I do. Like Life is Strange and Heavy Rain. I played either of those. Oh yeah, I seen I seen a show like that in real life before. I never wore it. I might wait. I might have wore it back in fifth grade. I can't remember. All right, something spikes at area hospitals. Oh shit. Who reads the newspaper anymore? <laughs> oh, guess where we're at? We're in the bathroom! Daddy? I don't even bother reading the newspaper, period. I see it from my mother and that's it. No, but I'm saying, who reads the newspaper anymore? All the news you need is on the internet now. Exactly. I barely bother with the news and that such. The newspaper, the newspapers become obsolete. Uh-oh, let's see what's happening on the, new, on the breaking news. Breaking news, McKay! Oh, shit. So, yeah. So, yeah, let's just say the end of the world is coming. Some kind of outbreak is going on. Oh, I love that lighting damn, effect. Damn you, Umbrella! <laughs> Yeah, there's only one way to find out. Oh. Okay then. Bad boys. I have to imagine how freaked out this kid has to be right now because she's only twelve. Yeah, she's one brave kid. That's Joel's phone. Yeah, why leave without your phone? Hey, look, it's a phone from 2010. <laughs> Actually, no, that's more like a phone from like 2007. Yeah, I'm going to be home late tonight. Go ahead and and and. Wow, I can't. I stand there here, right? Ed. Well, we ain't got time to cook no food. Reflections in the glass. Oh yeah, random fun fact. I actually got a Nintendo Switch today. Nice. Yeah. So it's a me and Ari has it. That leaves you, BSL, and the Gaia, Raza. Which one did you get? Uh, the 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 gray Joy-Con one. Alright. Yeah, I didn't want the color shit. <laughs> Oh shit! <laughs> hey, shit! Sir. Uh oh, there's a zombie. Okay, now this also has to be traumatizing for a child. Yeah. <laughs> oh god. Well, he had to shoot what he's supposed to do. Yeah, true. You yeah, guys, what happened to BSL? Uh, he's having computer issues for some apparent reason. And he's trying to hop. And he's trying to. He's trying his best to best his kid to hop in. Yeah, hopefully. Oh, yeah, that's his brother. Um, oh, what's his brother's name? Tommy. Yeah, I almost said Sam. <laughs> You've been playing too much Uncharted, mate. Yeah, that's what happens when you play so many Naughty Dog games. It get it get it'll, it'll get to you. Yeah, but this guy doesn't even look. <laughs> if anything, we're Sam. Sure thing. <laughs> I know. And, you know, Sam had more of a beard. <laughs> yeah, I love how when you turn the camera, uh, the freaking audio goes on the right side of your headphone, on the left. 
I, I kind of like the detail that she turns as you turn the camera. Yes. That's pretty neat. Did they say how many are dead? She got a little detail on everything. They don't quite give that justification for other games. <laughs> Dude, the grass looks freaking nice on this version. It's grass. How, do you, how would you fuck up grass? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, how you fuck up grass? Oh, how you fuck up the sky? <laughs> how you fuck up the dirt? <laughs> you have to be pretty bad at it to mess it up. Okay, if you fuck up dirt, there's a problem. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I hope we made out of love. <laughs> Um, well, well, it is possible to not know that you're sick. Just saying. I mean, it is a possibility that you don't know you, you're sick. But she was asking, she was asking, are we sick? Just to make sure she ain't sick. Uh oh. Okay, I'm gonna say right now, that was the, I think that was the right move. They they could they could have robbed them. I don't think that. Bad. Is it just me or when you turn the camera, did they just disappear? Oh, I don't know. No, no, they don't. I don't think they disappear. They were kind of gone after you went by. Maybe they weren't expecting you to turn around. Uh oh. Yeah, and it's just stand there and watch. Yeah, so, now you fucking drive. What the fuck is that? Fuck this shit, I'm out. <laughs> uh, Siri, you should be wearing your seatbelt. Matter of fact, all you should be wearing your seatbelts. Yeah, I don't want to run him over now. No, just... Oh, damn. That's why I say wear your seatbelts. Shoot, that's one hell of a crash. Oh, shit. Oh yeah, uh, oh a quick time event, kinda. Hit the button three oh, times to open shit, uh, cliche. So in case anyone wondering what's our three of our last one's part two, we don't know yet. Oh crap! Eat brick, kid. Remember that, remember that brick. We'll be using. We'll be using that later. Yeah, keep that in mind, folks. Hmm. Bricks are your friends in this game. But yeah, I actually did enjoy this. Uh, I just, I just started enjoying this when I first played it. I'm like, this is getting real. Holy shit! Yeah, I liked this game and everything, but it's just, I'm, I'm Oh! Not that's that That's that Michael Bay shit right there. Is that you, BSL? Yeah, you just get back. Alright. Alright, we had, uh... Alright, we had 14 minutes and, um, 12 seconds. Alright, that's hot in the movie theater. Hold all this glorious motion capture. Well, never mind. I'm at 1502. Alright. All right, uh, I'll cue I'll you when it's time. Yeah, you pretty much missed, pretty much missed a lot. There's a zombie apocalypse going on, and we have to escape. Get the fuck off. You go, Tommy. Alright, ten minutes. Ten, ten seconds, seconds, I mean. Ten, <laughs> ten minutes. I, I got it, I got it. Five, 
four, three, go. Two, one, go. <laughs> So yeah, the zombie populace is, is coming, and we have to escape. You know, the thing is, it's not even really zombies as they describe, as they, uh... Yeah, there's, some, they there's something else. They're not zombies, more like they may have been affected by something. Yeah. They, they tell you what it is, but it's, it's not like, um, Resident Evil style, like, zombie outbreak. It's... They actually used a real-life, um... <laughs> Fungal infection, but it's not one that affects humans. So I was gonna say, it's almost not like uh, freaking Resident Evil Seven kind of thing. And good. Hey. Fuck's sake! I see played through that. That's freaking disturbing as fuck. Oh boy. Okay, the soldiers. They think they're affected. Now behold this. Oh shit. Oh come on, don't freaking shoot them. Oh no. What the fuck is wrong with you? Oh! Go ahead, Tommy! My man! Oh, shit. Oh shit. Guys, guys. Now there comes this part. I'm gonna say right now, just hold on to your tears, or let it out if you have to. Yeah, this part fucked me over when I, when I, uh, when I first played this. Wait. She's dead, isn't she? She is. She's dead. Oh, fuck. Yeah, this part fucked, this part fucked me up when I first played this, no joke. I just hate that. Me too. You ain't the only one. Especially early in the game, right out the freaking damn bat. Exactly. Yeah, that was just a freaking that was just a freaking prologue. Timing. <laughs> yeah. Wow, for a second I thought I said uh, Bruce uh, Bruce Lee or something or Bruce Staley. Mike Yosh. If only there was an I there. Mike Yoshi. Just seems ridiculous seeing like this has a, like some infection spread around the world, and then I've seen like a bunch of friggin' zombie movies of uh, a bunch of zombie cocktails. Uh, some virus or some spread around, or some infection. They made like so many damn movies like that. But good grief, it's just ridiculous. Yeah. Yeah, but at least here they actually use something that actually exists. It's just, you know. Yeah, it actually makes sense, yeah. In, the other, in like other zombie games, it just sort of happens. Right, we just like don't know what it is. In summer, 20 years later. Oh, well, we are near in summer in a couple of months. Yeah, 20, yep, see, 20 years later. Oh yeah, if you see Joe in the uh, in that CG trailer, that's what part to it. Yeah, he's all old. He's old here. It's just we don't know how old he is here. I know. Right. And and uh, Elliot's like a teenager in that one. Oh yeah, that's 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 supposed to be his uh, supposedly uh, ex girlfriend. Okay. Yeah, Tess. Okay, as far as we know, Tess is just someone he works with. Yeah. We had a drop to make. Well, left alone, remember? Alright, the rest of it is just cutscenes and then parts over. So, Tess takes shit from nobody. That's why I love her. Jeez. Easy. You want 
explain this? I was on my way back here, and I got jumped by these two assholes. There's another thing I like about this game. This game actually has good partner AI coding in some areas. Like, when you get into, like, a combat sequence and Tess is with you, like, she'll actually start trying to actually kill people. Yeah. Well, that's good. At least she'll try to help. It's like, thank you for not being useless AI. What matters is that Oh, and you can't accidentally shoot your partner. Oh yeah, if I'm not mistaken, they uh, the, her her boss or whatever got got their weapons after she got her ass kicked. I forgot that dude's name. <laughs> All right, so, so, so our first chapter starts right now. But in the next video, mm. all right, later, folks.